Welcome to this uh, Windows Computer and Technology channel. And uh, somebody was mentioning uh, Windows updates and, you know, Windows updates is that scary thing for most people. And um, one of the promises of Windows 11, and we actually saw one of that promise today probably come true, is that Windows 11 will have smaller, faster, better updates. Today, when there was an update uh, of Windows 11, it actually went through through a cumulative update, and it was pretty fast. Uh, and it was very surprising. Um, small, it added features, it fixed bugs, went through faster than getting you know huge updates like feature updates. It was definitely an interesting aspect of the updates. So today's update that was released um, was very, very interesting on that. So you see it here, cumulative update and that moved up and bumped up. And it added a couple of new little things in Windows. So how better is it? Uh, it's still you know early on, but let's go back in time where Windows was a nightmare to update for tech guys. I still remember when you have Windows XP or when you had Windows, one of the worst was Windows 7. If you had to reinstall that thing, I mean, if you didn't have a streamlined, um, you know, install image that had tons of updates already on it, it was a nightmare to actually update. It would take hours to literally have Windows 7 up to the latest version with updates and honestly that way of doing things i am very happy windows 7 is gone that was the worst windows update pretty much of almost any operating system it was crazy slow when you needed to do it and it was always problematic people you know say well windows updates and windows 10 is so bad and stuff windows updates and windows 7 was one of the crappiest windows updates that that was it was worse than windows 10 i can tell you that if you think windows 10 was bad windows 7 was the king of the worst windows updates i can tell you that and the length of time and how you had to wait and and very little support you know they, they released an a update package which was a kind of a service pack. And the only reason they really released that is to try to make it easier to update your system and make it faster. And Windows 10, the Windows updates were greatly improved through a new system called cumulative updates. And cumulative updates are brilliant because if you install Windows, the update that you get contains everything that you need to update your system. There's no need to, you know, install update number one and two and three and four and five. And that cumulative update contains tons of updates in one big chunk that installs, which means, yes, you might have to restart a couple of times, but it's way faster than Windows 7 ever was. Uh, as for stability, there were some, you know, errors in Windows 10. There were some updates that broke stuff, uh, but that's pretty much been the timeline of Windows over years. It's not worse in Windows 10 than it was in any other operating system. But, you know, we talk about it. Uh, when I talk about what people mention, and we often talk about it, is what is people talking about? People always talk about when they have problems, but rarely talk about when it works well. The majority of people actually have great experience of Windows updates in Windows 10 in general. But yeah, there's this little ick up here and there. Now, today's update on Windows 11, I think is maybe a great indication of what's to come. Now, some of you are asking, is that Windows update feature or way of doing things coming to Windows 10? I don't think so. Um, I think these, this is unique to Windows 11, the way that it works. It will not be ported back to Windows 10. But it's definitely, I think, a step forward. And I think the promise we'll see with the next updates, the next weeks and the next months, and particularly also we'll see next year when it's released. But definitely, if it looks a little bit like today, it might actually be a pretty interesting and pretty good process overall. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.